So this video is going to demonstrate how to use OneDrive and share your files to Blackboard. Now, before we even get into that, I want to explain why you want to use OneDrive, what the big deal is. Well, here's the deal. Because you're saving files to your OneDrive folder, they're going to automatically sync to the cloud. So what you do is you install the OneDrive application on your computer. Then, instead of saving files to My Documents, you save them into the OneDrive folder. What happens is they're automatically uploaded into the cloud. So A, you've got a backup copy of it, and B, you've also got a copy that you can access from anywhere. So you could log into OneDrive from any computer in the world that has internet access and you'd be able to access your stuff. Now, why would you share the link in Blackboard? First, you don't have to upload a file. Um, you just create a link and insert the link. Then you can update the file in OneDrive, OneDrive and save it. If you've got any edits to make or if you find that you made a typo, instead of having to go back and re-upload the same file to every single class you teach, you just make the edit in OneDrive, save it, and you're done. Um, this also does not impact Blackboard course quotas, so you're not constantly contacting Mercer Online and saying, hey, my Blackboard shell is full, it's giving me this quota error. Uh, and lastly, presentations that are in OneDrive are fully mobile compatible, it means that your students can open up the presentation from anywhere, doesn't matter. They could be on their phone, tablet, PC, doesn't matter. They can open it up. So I'm going to do a quick demo on how to upload something into OneDrive and share it into Blackboard and show you what it looks like. So here I am, I'm inside of my OneDrive, and if I click on my demo folder right here, I'm going to drag a file in there, and here I'm going to pull over this window so you can see it. I've got some PowerPoint files. I'm going to drag this PowerPoint presentation right up, copy it into that folder, and it's going to take a second or two for it to upload, and you'll see right here it says uploading one item, and it's spinning. And once it's done uploading, and this is a pretty big file, this is like 35 megs, and it got done that quickly. So now I'm going to click on the file right here, click on the little blue checkbox, and then I'm going to click on copy link here at the top. And it's going to take a second because it's creating a link, and I right click on that link and I click on copy. So now I've copied that link to my clipboard. Next thing I'm going to do is go into Blackboard. So here I am inside of Blackboard. I want to build content. So I'm inside of the module, I hover over build content, and I click on web link. So I click on web link and I'm just going to say BB info session. And then under URL, I'm going to control V and just paste that link. Now, the links that OneDrive creates are, are huge and complicated. So don't try to just write it down and remember it. Copy and paste it. You'll be glad you did. And any, you know, any description comments you want to make, you do that. Uh, open a new window. I like to set it to yes. Um, and I'm going to scroll down and click submit. And this is what it's going to look like. So you'll see that there's the link icon right here. You'll see there is the file. And then when I click on it, it's going to open me up in a new window. And this is what it's going to look like to my students. Now, the thing, too, is that students will be able to download this. If they want to download it in a PowerPoint file, they can do that. They can click on download. They want to print it. They can print it. They want to print it to a PDF. They can do it from there. They can do pretty much anything they want to. Now, they will have to log in to the Mercer system in order to see this, but that's a good thing. It protects your material, it keeps it from being available to people wide open on the web. So that's uh, my, my song, that's my dance. I do hope you'll give it a shot. I think you'll find it a whole lot easier for you and for your students. Um, if you need any assistance, you can reach out to us at Mercer online at mccc.edu. 609-570-3389. Thank you.